happy Saturday! It's not normal that I'm here Saturday, but I'm collabing with Ronnie! Can they, can they hear me? Yeah, they should be able to. I No. Oh I'm god, sorry. now I have to double check. No, yeah, they can't hear you. <laughs> oh, that would have been embarrassing. Wouldn't it? <laughs> no, we're Everybody good. Doing? Hello. Hi, friend. I hope you're doing well. Uh, let's see. So today we're playing Season. Season is a... Hold on, let me actually bring up the actual thing about it. I hate that I didn't... Oh, aha, I did have it up. Uh, leave home for the first time to collect memories before a mysterious cataclysm washes everything away. Ride, record, meet people, and unravel the strange world around you. Immerse yourself in the world of Season, a third-person meditative exploration game. Can I just say, your stream layout is so clean. Thank you, thank you. I'm, I'm thinking about... Well, I'm not thinking. I am going to change it whenever I, like, get up my... 2d stuff um mostly because i just think like i feel like the screen could be bigger i feel like i have a lot of like wasted space uh hmm no i think you make a good use of your space yeah i don't know i love how for it everybody out. i love how for everybody it's like the goal to like go live 2d and for me i'm just like nope <laughs> i'm just gonna stay a little 2d guy forever I mean, I think that's fine. I think I'm definitely going to like keep using my PNG because I love them, but also like, I want to move. I want to be cool. I also have a really cool um model parent, so I want to look cool. I feel you. Yeah, but yeah, it really is like a lot of the time, like people are like, oh well. I'm pre-debut until I go 2D, and I'm like, just stream. <laughs> it's fine. Yeah. I started as it's like, always... started as like a literal GIF, not even like a GIF tuber. <laughs> just a little GIF. A GIF. Oh, just a GIF. Yeah. GIF tubers are kind of cool, actually. I kind of, I feel like that's really the evolution. Yeah. Like, from... Gifttubers are real. Are yeah, yeah, yeah. Gifttubers are really neat. Yeah. I um, I have like one of my alternates is a gift tuber. Um, she's all right. Definitely, maybe rushed a little too much. Um, especially for the price I paid. I'm not gonna talk about it, but <laughs> it's whatever. I like her. All right. Let's let's look at this game. Let's go into it. I couldn't do any like settings checks before I started so I was like ah whatever oh here it is <laughs> uh... you were reminders relative bike controls oh Heavily. Hmm. okay yeah that makes sense yeah what happens when it's off It feels like the same, but whatever. <laughs> uh, let's see. Borderless windows, fine. I'm not going to adjust. Well, is there even a? Oh, there is. I think it was fine where it was. Just barely visible. Oh my god! So right before this, I was playing Ishin with my significant other, and um, it had like one of these same things. So we set it to how they wanted us to do it. Um, we got in the game. It was super fucking dark. It was dark as fuck, yeah. <laughs> uh, oh. Bro, I, I always try to set it like a level up for what they think is the yeah. accurate one. Because it's like, bro, they want these games to be so dark. Right. I get it, it's cinematic, but I can't see shit. Right, I can't see. Um, I'm going to put the sound effect captions on. Um, that looks good. I like how there's <sighs> the accessibility. I love it. Um, no, I'll keep how that is. Hi, thank you for following. Hi, Drossy. I hope you are having a good Saturday. I hope you enjoy 
our commentary and flying through season. Why did I look at this? I'm not gonna remember any I, of this. <laughs> I am definitely the the comic relief. Yeah. That's who is the the straight the straight man the straight straight man in the situation. I know exactly what you mean. I'm ready to play my role. The role I was pulling upon. <laughs> Oh my god. The animation is already smooth. It really is. So let me... Oh no, good. It is coming to my headset. I was scared it was coming to my speakers. <laughs> Are you? I... am me. It's true. Who are you? I don't know, but I'm writing to you anyway. Where are you? How far in the future? Where'd you find my journal? I may never know, but you can know me from what I put down on these pages. Ah, so like geocaching. I come from a little village in the mountains. No one has left here since before I was born. But our lives changed overnight. Just a few days ago when my best friend had a prophetic dream. A vision that the Elder said means this season is going to end soon. The world is about to enter a new era. A great change is coming. Everyone was afraid. I was surrounded by questions and I began to feel how little I know. What is this season that is about to end? And why is it ending? What exactly the is voice out there that could it's really the good, right? right? Out? Also, we don't have to reach it. Yeah! If there are still voices singing and laughing <laughs> in the wilderness. I could record them before they're gone. I also thought of my dad, who always wanted to see the outside world but never did. So. I really like I how the elder looks. Clean. Like, yeah. I don't know. She just looks like an no elder. Condition for letting me go. But I it was very huge though as well. Involved. Right! The like it's giving, it's giving Ghibli for real. Yeah, yeah, definitely. She says it's the only place safe from the turmoil of a changing season. I hope that's where you're reading this now. I can't stop the change that is coming, but this time on Earth could live on in these pages. What it looks like, sounds like, how it feels to be alive right now. I'm writing to you at the crack of dawn on the morning I leave home. Uh, I wish I was going I can to cons. Smell breakfast cooking. Because I would cosplay the hell out of her. And I can hear my mom's voice. I mean, you don't need to go to cons to cosplay, right? Yeah. All right. An index. Past season, the letter to the future. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, there is reading. <laughs> I mean, I think this is everything that you just said. Oh, okay. It's just we didn't see all of the the pictures. Like, that's your best friend. Okay. Ah, oh, your dad. He looks kind. Yep, that's everything she said. Woo. That's like it's so <laughs> that <was what> <laughs> <kidding>. <laughs> It's like okay, we put all our money here. Good luck with the rest. Yeah. Three, two, one. Why? Hooray! Mr. Lotto's here. In Be universe. Mr. Lotto. <laughs> in universe, it feels alone. like he didn't get paid enough for that. Uh, this is my stuff. I can I get to it from this side of the bed somehow? A catalog of strangers. Fearsome tales for. Lasse children? Oh, I hit the wrong button. Okay. Mm. 
Oh, I see, I see. Okay. Introduction to the more frightful aspects of this world. A reasonable amount of fear and fun makes for prudent children. So, so are these like fairy tales or are they like, yo, you're gonna get eaten if you leave? Yeah, those kind of. <laughs> No time to do a lot of stories like that, you know, like be a good boy or you're gonna die. Yeah. <laughs> My bag. And it's always me. you're gonna die. For the great departure. Don't brush your teeth, goblins will like come take out your teeth. <laughs> <laughs> That's cool. That kinda reminds me of like Avatar. Yeah. Hope you like him more than you would have liked a fish. Did, did I want a fish? Wandering Tail Festival. I guess we're good at writing. What am I supposed to? Oh, folded by Pate. Yeah, who? You know what's funny? <laughs> <laughs> it's just funny. Like, you gotta take credit for a paper plate. You gotta write your name. Yeah. Like, <laughs> I need people like... to know that I, I was the one who folded this. Exactly. This is really pretty. It's also pretty terrifying. A little bit. How the fuck? I don't know. Like, how did it keep its shape completely? I don't know. That's fun. That's some cool looking. Owl money. spreads her wings over prosperity. This bill is worth ten poems. It. Oh, so it's fake money. Okay. It's like monopoly money. Uh, okay, I guess I have to go this way. Oh, fuck, wait, wait no, go back. <laughs> God oh, damn it. Progression. <laughs> um, let's study the scene. The burner's on the table, ready to make a pendant. Mom is cooking sweet bark soup. She got out some old tapes. Like branch soup? Like tree I soup? What I'm assuming is like... The tree is like aromatics for the soup. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm guessing. What are you doing standing there? I like the comic panels. It's it's a nice change from like regular subtitles. Time to get Mom, going. I'm leaving to categorize the animals. <laughs> it's gonna be a Don't try to stop morning. me. <laughs> I'm making progress. I found the burner, camera, recorder, travel bag. Breakfast is in progress. Still gotta make a pendant. To keep me safe? We haven't used this in so long. Good thing I saved the instructions. Just as you would use a shield to protect your body, an identity pendant protects your mind. Can I also talk about how much I like the... Okay, we've only seen one character with fashion, but I love her fashion. <laughs> Your thoughts, memories, everything that makes you, you. Like, I could see myself wearing that jacket. We don't wear them here in the village anymore. But if you're going into the outside world... I'll you, you can hear me, right? Yeah, yeah, I can hear you. Okay. Okay. Uh, I guess I'll against what? Yeah. Diseases of the mind. Oh, I hate those. Yeah. Those are the worst kind. <laughs> like the dream sickness. Ah, uh, so I was gonna like say like, oh, like, I think what I was going for was like, I don't know, some sort of disease. But the first thing that came into my mind was osteoporosis. And I'm like, no, that's the bone, buddy. That's not the mind. <laughs> <laughs> All right, which one? come from? All right. We don't know what caused it. We heard people suddenly fell into an eternal sleep. Oh. These were years of wild rumors. And half of them turned out to be true. Oh. In times of war, a pendant can be used to identify a body. Ah, so like dog tags. <sighs> Let's skip that part. Objects have two layers, the physical and the mental. 
the pendant needs to absorb both. One, collect a sentimental object for each sense. Sound, smell, feel, sight, taste. Wait, I thought you were making breakfast. Is the breakfast going into the pendant? Yes. Uh, well, I guess I wasn't Two, hungry anyway. Feel the sense and speak aloud a memory of the object. Three, feed the object into the burner. The memory will leave the speaker as it is transferred to the pendant. You know, this is actually something similar that, um... It's not all the way similar, but, uh, witchy life story. Great game. Great life sim. Um, you're a witch in it, and you're helping the townspeople. And at first you try to use, like, magic, but around the end you're like, Oh, well I can use different, like, self-help techniques. And so, for one person, you kind of do the same thing, because, you know, she wants to leave, but she's worried about, like, the village. And yeah. you're like, yeah, you know, like, go to one of your favorite places, like, pick a sense, like, you know, sit in it, talk about it. <laughs> and then, um, get something, like, physical from it, I guess, or something, I don't know. Um... But it's kind of the same thing. That means I'll forget the memory after I say it. Uh, except there wasn't that. Oh, I saw the ads for that game. It was like, what What if you could play Kiki's Delivery Service? Wait, are we talking about the same game? Are we? Didn't you play it during the game? The game game? Oh, that was that was uh, Mika's and the Witch Mika and the Witch's Mountain. Um, there's a different oh. game I'm talking about. Uh, it's called Witchy Life Story. It's like a life sim. Um, wow. Okay. I think I played it somewhere late last year. Because it came out late last year. Uh, around, around Halloween. Oh, it's supposed okay. to be painless. Yeah. At least. Painless? Losing your memory. Let's try. Let's try. Um. Okay, so, this old tape should work for our sense of sound. I remember... Let's see, ooh, this you music. You asleep listening to this tape. Your dad can come. We all rested together until it got dark. Aww. And I'm gonna forget this? <laughs> Look at it filling up with that memory essence. Yeah. What an odd feeling. No, we both forgot. <laughs> like an absence disappearing. Wow, oh, this is terrible. The empty space the worst. fills itself back in. Wow. Until I forget that I forgot anything at all. Wow, oh, this is <sighs> sucks. This sucks. This sucks. <laughs> Maybe we shouldn't have did it. <laughs> few memories. If I lost too many, I wouldn't even know who you are. Uh. Damn, don't foreshadow that. What the don't fuck? Don't do that. Mom, Who's please. Mom? mom, what the fuck? <laughs> I lose the memories, but you'll have them in a pendant forever. Oh, you lose them! What? So they should be in Fuck! Wait, so are we supposed to go back to the room and grab some of those things? I think so, yeah. Jesus Christ! I know! Okay. Take the fucking bird. Fuck the bird. <laughs> yeah, fuck the bird. Uh, love the mood of your stream. You picked my curiosity, and I'll come back for sure. The fact is it's 1 a.m. here and I kind of need to go to sleep, so bye. Yes, please, go to sleep. Get some good sleep. Thanks for stopping by. I really appreciate it. Yeah, have, have a good one. Have a good rest, you know? I'm not I'm not always here. From 1 a.m. is a good time. Identity. Yeah, it is. Be sure to protect. Like Olive Garden. When you're here, you're... <laughs> <laughs> about what these items and what the memories would preserve about you. I was talking about Olive Garden the other day to someone. I don't think the breadsticks are unlimited anymore. Next. Or maybe they're more expensive? Probably better for people's health, if anything. Yeah, yeah probably. Strong odor. Odor. And that holds a Yeah, that bird, that thing fucking stung. <laughs> I 
Oh, before I do any of that, ah, look at this photo. What if you end up grabbing it? No, it's fine. It's fine. Nothing. I was born in the glow of my parents' love. That's cute. Oh, okay, good. There's a, like, additional thing. Nothing. I remember who my dad was. Uh, what the fuck does that say? I went out for a climb. Be back this evening. XOXO. Did, did you come back? Gonna throw dad in the fire. No! Throw dad in the fire. <laughs> I don't think it's smelly. Have you seen my dad dance? Boy, does he stink. <laughs> does this stink? Uh -huh. what, did that, what did that spin stink? I look closely. Uh, is, is there something on the bottom? Uh, nope. Put I back. I kind of want to see if you can take the bird. Wait, where, where's the... <laughs> oh, where's the bird? On the desk. The, on the desk. Yeah. Oh! Nothing. I take care of fragile things. I assume that if it's stinky, she'll react to it. That's my guess. Saint Damp Canyon. Yeah! A friend gave me this a long time ago. Alright, right now you're the only one with smell. But let's see what else we got. Nothing. I collect stories. I don't know why I thought that would work. Uh, uh, hmm. Do you stink? Tangled nest, sour play. This speaks to how my dad loved me. Throw it in the fuck. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Let's see. Maybe there's something in the other room for us. Uh, dried flowers. Ancient perfume, sweet. Nothing is ever lost. I, I, I think maybe we do gotta pick that sweet stuffed animal. Sweet honey. How I've tried to save things. That's love for me, stunk. <laughs> uh, what's up here? Ginger drink. Oh, hold on. I think that, Childhood. yeah. Too sweet, too old. I always wanted to experience new things. This reminds me of fucking, uh... Yeah, it's one of those, oh, this is good for everything. So when I was a kid, and when I was with I my... it was good for nothing. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, when I was with my grandma, she used to give me this fucking cold medicine called Buckley's. It was the worst Granite, fucking medicine seaside, in my life. <laughs> darkness. This speaks to how my mom loves me. Age nine. Mom doesn't even remember. And mom doesn't oh, remember. <laughs> mom doesn't even remember. How does it speak to how she loves baby me? Baby <laughs> waves. I was loved by people I have no memory of. I think it actually doesn't matter. It doesn't matter? Okay, what should we put in there? I don't even feel like that. Put the bird in there. Put the bird in <laughs> Oh. Mmm. What if we put the bird in for, like, sight? Well, eh, it's fine. Let's get it. Uh, select for pendant. Mom's gonna be like, buddy, what? What did you choose for smell? It's fucking bird, because it's smell. <laughs> See? <laughs> you're right, you're right. Boy, this thing stinks. <laughs> I remember your friend Pate made this little bird. You wanted to protect- Oh, you about to forget Pate? Oh, no! <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for following Princess Lizzilla. I really appreciate it. I hope you enjoy your time here today. I thought it wouldn't be- Hi, Liz. It's just a bit of folded paper. But you took good care of it, and years went by. I'm surprised it's not, like, yellowing. You'd done it. It was still intact. 
That was and now we're throwing it in the fire. I understand what kind of person you are. You will chaperone these delicate things into the future. Now you'll forget what kind of person I am. Yeah. Mom will be like, uh, what do you do? Like, what is your purpose? <laughs> now okay. touch. Hello, hello, and love the energy here. You seem really chill, Sesu. Thank you. I'm mostly chill, unless Make I'm playing with Hollow Knight. You like. <laughs> with a texture I like. The little ceramic thingy. Yeah! Ah, uh, this one. My bag oh. and dad's camera. And no, Thanks that's not going departure. in. <laughs> Just put <laughs> dad's camera in there. <laughs> wait, wait, no, 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 wait, 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 wait. Actually, Palm. The stuffed animal. Oh, yeah, My let's get that guy out of here. Long time ago. Get him, get him. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna put Where you back. You? The fucking terrifying ass stuffed animal. Yeah, let's get this guy out of here. Fabric, skin, plush, limbs. This speaks to how my dad loved me. <laughs> Mom's Can't not gonna that. remember. <laughs> so what did you end up choosing? Mr. Okay. Lodo. Feel the object. I remember. You used to take him everywhere with you. Aw. One night, you forgot him in the plaza. It was cold and rainy that night. But your dad leaped into action as if the doll was a real member of the family. Aw, cute. I have this it's still image gotta of go. his face as he ran out into the My street. dad Completely is serious. insane. He no thought that hesitation. the puppet was a part of and our family. Dad returned <laughs> the doll, I forgot for a moment that he's just fabric. Stitched Mom also the went insane for a little bit <laughs> and forgot that it was made of fabric. He had a soul because you'd projected one into him. What was dear to you? was dear to us. Aw, that's cute. That was... We were whole for a little while. I thought it was a lot bigger. Oh, I didn't see you get thrown in. Was it, like, tiny? <laughs> yeah, it was, like, kind of the size of my hand. Tiny hands. Tiny hands. Uh... Tiny hands. Are you okay? I'm fine. You are not fine. You are not fine. Pick something that... that looks nice. That looks nice. Yo, she's not okay! She's not okay! Something that looks nice. Take one of the plates. I don't think I can. An is it, what is that? Yes, that looks nice. It's loved by it people look nice. I have no memory of. I was thinking about either this or like the insect husk. Okay, do the husk. Yeah, cause it's really cool. Yeah. And maybe, you know, mom will forget something that doesn't pertain to her. <laughs> Poisoned. Blue. Shine. I look closely. Oh. But mom's gonna be like, I once thought this was a part of our family. <laughs> so, what did you end up choosing? I was like, why do you keep picking things that relate to me? your pants. <laughs> See? I check the pockets and find all kinds of little things you collected off the ground. Rocks, leaves, bits of string, and bugs. So did you wash it the bugs? It less and less as you got older. But I remember the afternoon I found this beautiful blue beetle in your pocket. Poisonous. Oh, yeah, I poisonous. This might be the last time. And this dead insect suddenly became so precious to me. Mom, I, I think it's okay if you remember, if you forget this what one. Is it in our young <laughs> eyes that imbue every small thing with meaning. Why do we lose this? I don't think you ever did. You thought you should seem kind of emotionless. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> My mom was like, Poor taste. I thought it was part of the family. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking dunk it in the box. Right.
I want to see what else is in this soup. The memory I'll lose is the one we're forming right now. You know, I think that's I okay. I to have it forever. What? You gonna, you gonna forget the moment I leave? Well, I, I, I think she'll see me leave. But she'll forget that we're eating soup together. That we ate soup before we Standing left? Here, yeah. You're having a last taste of home. As soon as we put Mom, it in, she'll be like, Hey, did you eat? Mom, Mom you can send the soup with us. <laughs> You can make soup to go. Soup gets better the long it sits. Now you're protected. I don't know about that. <laughs> uh, of home. Is that gonna be like our health bar? Uh, I don't know. I hope that like. This is my only know. condition for letting you go. You must promise me never to take the pendant off. Oh, we're gonna take that off at some point. And never tamper with it. We're gonna do that too. Uh, I'm trying not to. Yeah. Okay. I can't make any promises, then Mom. I'm, okay I'm sorry. You leaving. I think your camera and bag are still in your room. It's time to gather them up. All right, let's do it. This is this is like the the Pokemon tutorial at the beginning. <laughs> yeah. But like. <laughs> Except it's more, it's more how it should be. Like, yeah. <laughs> I'm 12 and I'm leaving, mother. Mom is like, bye. <laughs> Get out of here, kid. Me and Mr. Mime got things to do. <laughs> <laughs> your mom's gonna take a picture. Wait, she's gonna take a picture of her. Your mom's like, I don't even Love know you. So much. <laughs> how could Mom, why are you guilty me? You too. Mom. Mom. <laughs> you take it? Uh, nope. It'd be funny if- Oh, you don't. Yo, it'd be so funny if you, like, just took a picture of her jacket, like, ooh, this jacket is nice. <laughs> Look at us. There we are. Throw it in the pot. <laughs> no! There we were. I don't understand why we just didn't take two selfies together. I'm sure we could have done it. We'll always be right here. On this beautiful morning. We're making jokes, but this shit is very beautiful. It really is. Very loving. And I, I think it makes sense, you know? They're like secluded. I wonder what these bike what these bike physics gonna be like. Me I too. Imagine. Cause that's what the whole game is kinda of based on. If these yeah. are bad, I would be so heartbroken. <laughs> Uh, open journal. I just performed oh. a ritual with my mom. The moment has passed, but I'll record it in these pages for you for the future. Right back. I gotta use the bathroom. Okay. That gives me. Oh, that was loud. Yeah, it gives me a chance to fucking close the door. It's so loud all the time. <laughs> All right, I'll wait till Ronnie gets back. I hope you guys are having a good day. I had a good day. What did I do? What did I do today? Um, we started playing, me and my partner started playing uh, the new Like a Dragon Ishin game. Um, what I find really cool about the game is that it has like a, it has like a cinematic mode for like vintage period drama but also it's so dark that it's hard to see so we couldn't keep it on <laughs> but it was a fun time did i i did i did set my alarm okay and then the medicine i have to take is right here then i take that in an hour 
I'm gonna take that, and now I'm gonna have to. Okay. Uh, let's see what else did I do today. Um. I've been trying to extend my reach on TikTok, so I've been making TikToks. Um, I played a lot of Steam Next Fest demos like a few weeks ago, so I've been doing that. Uh, I've been doing like a top 10, and um, you know, I had two friends go like, wow, thanks for the recommendation. So honestly, I don't care about what happens after this. I'm just happy that, you know, Someone is like, oh, that's a good recommendation. Thank you. I could take that. Because that's what I want in the end. I want people to play more indie games. Like this! Can you hear me? Yeah! Alright, I'm ready. Okay. I was just making conversation while you came back. Talking about my my morning. And, um... Like to fill me in? Yeah. Uh, I played Ishin. Ishin has like a, it's like a, it's like a samurai Yakuza. Well, it, it's the Yakuza game, except it's a samurai yeah, one. Yeah, um, pretty much. So it has like a cinematic mode where uh, uh -huh. it kind of goes like a period drama. So like, you know, it's a little darker, it's more grainy, but it's too dark. So we couldn't use it. Oh, um, you guys were like, oh, I see. Yeah, yeah. I've seen people playing it on stream though. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, we were um, my significant other usually streams like whatever we play on PS Five for our friends, so he was streaming it on that. Um, but yeah, it was just putting it on cinematic mode was too dark for us, so we had to turn it <laughs> off. Um, no, yeah, and then I uploaded a TikTok today because I'm doing like a top ten of the indie demos I played from the Next Fest. Um. I had a friend the other day say, thank you for the recommendation. I wish list it. And at that point, I was like, wow, I don't care what happens for the rest of this. I'm I'm good. I don't care if no one else <laughs> looks at it except for like two people. That's fine. Influence. I have influence. <laughs> I just I really like I really like indie games. So I want people to play more indie games. Um, and I like sharing indie games. So, you know. I enjoy indie games as well. Yeah. It's oh, just... it really showed all the shit that we put in it. Yeah. <laughs> That's so sad. <laughs> we'll keep the memories for mom. Well, not all of them. Uh, we I got how, the. Like, it was supposed to be. It was supposed to be do all the things we like. Yeah. And we just put all the things we hated. We just put random shit in there. Yeah. <laughs> All right, how do I how do I get out? Oh, probably like this. No, how do I get out? I did this. Yep. Back maybe or B? B O triangle X. Maybe it's pause. Oh no! Hit the uh, hit the touch bar on your controller. Yeah, I'm hitting it. Hold on, let me make sure that I'm like. Yeah, I'm in the game. So. Yeah, I'm hitting it. <laughs> what the fuck? Bro, don't tell me we're soft lock. I no! Believe this. Press everything. Try back. Jesus Christ. This oh will be a very God. glaring issue. <laughs> Are you sure? You're not supposed to swipe across the, the touch bar. Oh, wait. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. What's that doing? Uh, I didn't try swiping. I did touch it, though. Come on, buddy. Come on. Come on, buddy. Bro. Bro. <laughs> Ain't no fuck away. <laughs> I gotta do this all over again? Or did it auto- oh wait, hold on. I think it auto-saved. Okay, okay. Let's- let's exit and come back- oh wait, hold oh, on. God. Oh no, this we is fine. Do... If it saves and exits, that's fine. Oh, okay. Carlo Village. Alright, cool. Alright. Yeah. You not I just the performed a ritual with my mom. You just opened the journal. Yeah, I don't think it'll let me not. <laughs> in these pages for you for the future. Oh my god. <laughs> what is going Bro. on? Okay, I'll I'll see if I can 
do this without... Hold on. Let's look at the controls. Yeah, what about the closed journal? Hold on. Let me... Nope. Oh my god. Mm. <laughs> All right. That's incredibly strange. That's so strange, right? Yeah, it won't let me not do it. Damn, we might be soft locked. All right, hold on. Let me let me switch to my keyboard and mouse. Okay, tab. I just performed a ritual with my mom. Yep. The uh, moment has passed, but I'll record it in these pages for you for the future. Okay, I'll shift. I'll look through all these. I'll back. And then I'll tab out. I'll tab out. <laughs> what is going on? Um, hmm. I'm going to see if anyone else has problems with this. Hold on. Jesus Christ, okay. So, this, is, this is something. I find it humorous, but also I feel like people have played past this, right? So, like, is it just me? Maybe look for a playthrough and see if they it just worked. Because you might have to just close the game or reopen it. Yeah, I'm going through, um, I'm looking at their, uh, the discussions. I'm going to see if anyone else has talked about it in this, um... Let's see. Am I the only one that had difficulty? Oh, the stuff I'm not even in. Uh, please report issue. You have an issue with the game. Uh, I'm not going to look through all this. Let's just close it, close it, and come back in. Let's see if that works. As soon as I... There we go. No, let's just close it, close it. Let's get all the way out. Uh, which gives me a chance to take my medicine, actually. I'm hoping... You was really crunching those... Huh? You was really crunching those pills. Oh, no, 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 I was opening the bottle. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I can't, I can't crunch these. <laughs> I don't want you to sit through and just bit. I was like, oh no. <laughs> Your poor dental plan. I spent too oh. much money on my teeth. I'm not doing anything like, like that. I was like, Jesus Christ. <laughs> not your molars. <laughs> Man, I had to do like adult braces so like because it came out of my own pocket i'm like i'm not doing anything <laughs> that's gonna mess up my uh, teeth for well, three times a day yeah <laughs> all right you, you better fucking work i just performed a ritual with my mom yep the moment has passed but i'll record it in these pages for you but this guy can close it right now all right we're gonna go here okay it wasn't letting him close it either Oh, really? Yeah, hold on. How did he... How did he get past this? Oh, you're some... Oh, shit! What are you supposed okay, to do? No, it was us. It was us. You're supposed to place the items in the book. What? Like, you're supposed to scrapbook the drawings into the book. Oh! <laughs> I didn't say that at all! Yeah. Oh, my God. Okay. Okay. That makes more sense. All right. Wow. Wow. <laughs> I need to the rescue. Yeah. <laughs> uh, oh, can I rotate this? Yeah, I can. Okay. Now it looks like a plaque. That shit would have sucked so bad. Yeah, if we couldn't figure it out. Oh, oops. Journal beautifier. I never knew when my mom would share a memory of mm. dad. 
while cooking on a walk with no warning. It knocked the wind out of me. Rituals take this grief and give it a shape and a story. Filling in this journal is a ritual too, but for a loss that hasn't hit us yet. To place those. <laughs> it's fine. I still gotta. Oh no, mom, mom, where are you gonna go, mom? Look, see, that's why I said you should have been more strategic. Oh no, it wasn't. Oh, I can move him. I can move him. Woo! Yeah. Uh. Mom, I'm gonna put mom you deserves right here. better than. <laughs> <laughs> you're right. You're right. Mom should. Okay, you sit over here. Mom gets over here. Mom gets prime, prime real estate. Uh, you can go up here. This guy. This guy gets all the space. There we go. That's a little bit better. Is there, there's something else? Oh, okay. You're not sure it's me, by the way. I'm not? Oh, because I, I closed it. Closed. Hold on. Yeah. There you go. Thank you. You're welcome. Oh, you can also... If I knew. You like scrapbooking. If I knew. Now I gotta change everything. Oh no. Oh, I can scale it. This is great. This is great. Um... Put that with mom. At the end, I will give you a grade. Oh no. <laughs> I know I was being graded. Uh, like this. Uh, why is there just a line? Um, I guess I'll put that here. This will be on the test. No! <laughs> uh, scale. Put that right on top of there. Actually, hold on, I know what I want to do. I'm gonna put this here. I'm gonna move this, I don't know, here. Uh then we're gonna make it right here. You can put the pink line under the goodbye ritual tag. Yes! Yes! I'll let me scale it. I kind of liked it better when I was bigger. <laughs> yeah. Perfect. There we go. Uh, and then if I make this... Yeah, I'm just going to make this huge. Forgot the rest in a second. Because it's got to look That's like... What she... no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait. Hold on. Actually, this was the opposite. It was like... It's like this. Because it came out from there. Uh, I'm gonna put it up here. Actually, no. That should have stayed in the middle. I believe I thought that was supposed to take five seconds. <laughs> <laughs> but you don't understand. It has to be perfect. Forgot how to That's scale. That's you. Interior designer. Oh no, don't hire me for interior designing. Your house is gonna look like shit. <laughs> oh, let's see. Put this here, this like here, and this like this. I don't really know what the teacup doing, but it's gonna stay here, I guess. Okay, what? Hold on. Ah. <laughs> uh, uh. Okay, what's my grade? Okay, let me see. Flower under the knapsack, bird under the mom. Very metaphorical, you know, very, very, very... Hmm. You want out of 10 or out of 5? Uh, give me out of 10, chef. I feel like some of the placement is a little, is a little random. I'll give it a, I'll give it a, a 4. Oh my god, I'm going home this season. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> 
broad tool. A six out of ten. The sights and oh, that's a little bit better. I'll, I'll get better. Recording the only place I've ever known. A true friend is honest with you. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. Oh, no. This reminds me of Public um... sleep music is a tradition of ours here. When the music ends, the village will begin to wake up. Oh. Uh, it reminds me of Miles Morales, um, because you can take like uh sound bite samples too in the game. Um. Can you? Yeah. I didn't know that. Yeah, it's super cool. Uh, I guess I'll. Record the water. We have plenty of fresh water here. I wonder if it's more scarce in the outside. Hey, room. I'm still here. I just gotta meet for a second. Okay, no worries. I wonder where we get the fresh water from. Is it groundwater or spring water? Last night there was a goodbye party here in the plaza. Everyone was so afraid for me. Oh, that's right. To understand that fear, to understand where I grew up, you have to know the man standing watch over the plaza, Dr. Funio. Where? Oh, there. Oh, oh, okay, okay. Um, let's zoom. Let's focus. Yo, this is cool as hell, okay. Oh, focus range. Okay. Uh, what kind of filter can I put on it? Uh, let's see. I think... Maybe cool. Yeah. Take the... This is Dr. Fumio and his son. The statue isn't as old as it looks. The artist wore it down to give it a feeling of ancientness. Oh, that's the cool. that comes with it. Dr. Funio and his son founded Cairo back in 776. They live on through our traditions. I feel like I probably could have got closer up for that. And record the audio. The audio of... Oh, okay, an instrument. Alright. There are three murals celebrating Dr. Funio's work. Uh, that looks like it might be one of them. Yeah! Oh, cool! You can trigger walk or run. We march the day... No, we mark the day. Dr. Fumio cured memory excess. Hmm. It's... Oh, okay. Uh... I'm gonna change the filter on this. Ooh, the pastel looks good. All right, that's what I'm taking. Remembering everything must be painful. Dr. Fumio brought peace to so many people here. He helped them forget memories? Uh, let's see, let's see. Oh, right. I don't have to walk like this, I can run. Ah, uh, this must be mural number two. We mark the day Dr. Fumio cured... <laughs> what? Uh, maybe the camera will help. Time misperception disorder? We need that range big. Uh, what filter shall I put on this? Hello! How are you? How are you doing? Do you prefer I call you App or Apple or Apple Juice? Let me know. 
I am here with my friend Ronnie, who is currently muted. Uh, we're playing Season, A Letter to the Future. It is a uh, narrative exploration game. Uh, hmm. Maybe I'll do the high contrast on this one. Whichever, okay. The elder sought out Dr. Fumio to cure her mother, who was suffering from time misperception. Yeah, it's a really it's a really good game so far. We're still like in the beginning. Um it it's very atmospheric, very cool. Thank you, thank you, I really appreciate it. The person that made my PNG tuber is named Drichi uh on Twitch and Tumblr. Tumblr? Twitch and Twitter. I I don't know if she's on Tumblr actually. Uh, a wish fell this? off the tree. I'm not supposed to read them. But it might be good for you to have an example of one. Okay. Um so kind of the kind of the premise of this game is that uh the main character is getting ready to go out into the world. Her best friend had like a prophet like a like a fortune telling dream and um she was like, all right, I got to go out in the world. But um, she comes from a village that's very, uh, very secluded. Like, they don't leave ever. So it's kind of a big deal that she's leaving. I hope she comes back and tells everyone it's safe to leave. Scary. I can go against tradition a little for posterity. Yeah. Uh, ooh, I think this is it. What is that? Music and poetry tonight. Okay. This is the cafe where my dad used to read his poems. He wrote one for me. Maybe he wrote it for you too. Maybe. So right before this, uh, we had a scene with our mom who, uh, uh, we can't see it on the character, but she has like a pendant that she received from her mother. And, um... We had to put in like items close to us into kind of like this cooking pot, like this melting pot. And um, my mother forgot the memories. So this pendant could protect me from the disease of the mind. Also, welcome back. Yes, we threw away all the shit. <laughs> <laughs> we threw away all the shitty stuff. Goodbye, Caro Fish in the Sky. Come to think about it, who would throw a picture of their fucking dad in there? Jesus Christ. I don't know. I daydream of leaving this place, of seeing something weird. I hope I see Pate before we leave. Dream sickness lives on. Oh, we gotta... We're too close. Hold on. I gotta do the, the opposite of Zoom. Okay. Uh, let's see. I like the pastel. Take a picture. Dr. Fumio said the dream sickness was caused by something very powerful. He wasn't able to cure it. Uh, scary. Um, okay. I have to find... A musical instrument? No, 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 I'm looking for my keepsakes. Uh, let's see. Yep, I have that one. Oh, fuck. Uh, we got this one. And then we got this one. Have you just one. been recording sounds and taking pictures? Um... I took pictures. I need to record a sound of this, but I gotta find it first. I'm assuming once you leave this town, the enemies will show up. The enemies? You don't think there'll be enemies? Ah! Uh, I I don't know. I would assume that's what the pendant protects you from. I I would assume it too. Like an old man's toes dipped in cinnamon. What? That's very specific. That was so. 
supposed to protect my brain. Oh, there it is. This thing. Yeah, I gotta record this thing. This is a cool ass instrument. This is a healing instrument created by Dr. Fumio. It draws on the pure mountain air. That's cool as hell. Uh, nope. I would. There we go. What do you think the enemies will look like? Will they be like the darkness? Person. But we also um, just have a need to put a human face on events that are beyond our control. I hope they don't have limbs. He may have felt just as What? And <laughs> I hope they don't have limbs. <laughs> I want them to be kind of ghostly or something. Do limbs freak you out? Um. Kinda. <laughs> if they're just I like dark. They limbs, then. No! <laughs> Oh, oh, cool. That's hella cool. No, don't place it like that. Place it like a paragraph, like the other ones. Yeah. Like a little more, a little more spread out. Like a little, a little more, more like, spread out, like this. Yeah. Wait, oh, a little less. Wait. A little less. <laughs> Wait. Like this? Uh, a little Maybe lower. a little more. Yeah, perfect. Yeah. There we yeah. go. Yeah. The problem is, we have another. <laughs> Where is this supposed to fit? Um, hmm. you edit the other text? Uh, nope. It was already here. Uh, <laughs> Alright, make it longer and then place it at the bottom of the other page. This is as long as I can make it. Wait, what happens if you just place it? Can you move it after? Yeah. Alright, move the fucking mandolin. No, no, it's not a mandolin, but that's the word I'm gonna use. <laughs> Can you not move it? Uh, I can. Oh, okay. Uh, but it's like the mandolin thing smaller. Let's, yeah, let's put it like up. Can you stop? <laughs> stop that, buddy. Um. The fact that you keep trying to like lower it, like. There we go. <laughs> Make it a little longer. I can't. It's as oh, big okay. as it gets. Yeah, it should fit right there. Yeah. Yeah. Whoever's reading this keepsake journal is gonna be like, buddy, what? <laughs> Why'd you try to do this? Were these even in order? Hmm? <laughs> I'm just like, yeah. Uh Alright, what else are we doing, buddy? So apparently they had like a like a going away party. Um and they they put like a bunch of wishes on a tree that uh I'm not supposed to look at, but I looked at one. Um, I'm trying to see if it's in here. It's not. But it said, I hope she comes back and tell us that it's safe to leave. <laughs> and I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> Maybe it's like a society where like they were taught that it's not, that it's, the world is scary. Yeah, I mean, there is like, you know, this man coming to cure the memory excess. Maybe, and, like, uh, outside of here, people are consistently, like, losing memories, like, crazy. Yeah. That's what I'm thinking. Honestly, maybe take off the the, the sound subtitles? Yeah. <laughs> or I or thought they would... smaller? I thought they would go, like... Usually when there's sound titles, they go, like, on the top left or something. Um, so I found it kind of wild that they put it, uh... Here we go. Um, uh, what's edit? Maybe oh, subtitle no, text just, size? Okay. We'll change um, it? Yeah, see? Maybe like small? I think that just works on- oh wait, no, it works on both. Um, yeah. Yeah, maybe that'll- maybe that'll work. Right, small. <laughs> oh, small? Okay, hold on. I hit the wrong button. Let's try small. And you have them off again. Oh. Alright. Let's see how that works. I 
I just assume I had to come back this way because that way was a dead end, but I don't actually know. We'll find out. The game is very cinematic. Don't be like us. <laughs> we spent freaking 10 minutes trying to figure out how to put stuff on the ship. <laughs> we really did. Uh, By myself, I have nope. one brain cell. <laughs> and Insetsu has two. And together, we <laughs> make 30. <laughs> Together, somehow we still have two. I think I lose a brain cell somewhere. <laughs> I apparently did go the wrong way. Yo, why are these windows open? Maybe this way? Nope. All right. Must have missed something down here. Oh wait, hold on. Do I still gotta... I gotta record the fucking birds in the tree. Okay. There are birds wherever you As go, birds buddy. Birds migrate, but we don't know where they come from or where they're going. Gentle sound of water flowing. Oh, over here, I guess. Nope, not a picture. I remember soaking my feet in here on hot days. Oh, what's this? I love it. I'm going to keep this. Hate loves fish, even though nobody here has ever seen one. Wait, y'all ain't never seen a fish? What do they eat? Oh, they are eating bark soup. I just realized. Yeah. That. <laughs> Tastes like home. <laughs> oh uh, yes, trees. They make me hungry. Yeah, like. Do y'all just eat trees? Are you vegetarian? <laughs> do you find meat Look from somewhere? <laughs> wait, wait. <laughs> I just had a funny thought. When they look around and you see the other tree, look at all this plentiful food! <laughs> <laughs> oh yes. my god. That is a dinner tree. And that is a breakfast tree, you can tell. Okay, well I mean... <laughs> they are in the fucking sky, so... Maybe they do just eat trees. Damn, like... that's a that's an interesting invisible tree. Yeah, maybe they maybe they catch birds. I don't I don't know. Like a fishing rod just there. Did that not <laughs> like a fishing rod? What oh, I thought it. For? I thought it was like a. It's a fishing rod. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> Are they fly fishing? I. T <laughs> but none of them never seen a fish. So what are they fishing for? Founded seven, 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 Hill ten. Village seven, was founded ten. during the modernity. Much later, Doctor Fu. The modernity, y'all the fish are. <laughs> Can you really call yourselves modern? Amazing. This is the Stone Age, -ity. <laughs> They do got some pretty drippy clothes, though. So maybe. I'll, yeah. Maybe I'm <laughs> one wallin. This flower means. You're in my thoughts. Ah, uh, yes. Let's put the flower in our scrapbook. The morning after the search was called off for Dad, our doorstep was covered in them. Ah. Hey, get this shit off my... <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> my mask. <laughs> Just get this shit off my lawn. Really, though? Um... Let's see. It'll be cool. Okay, can you turn it? Uh... 
I guess. Okay, place it like sideways, like and then like place it on like yeah, next to Cairo Village. Yeah, yeah, okay. Nice. Uh, it's okay if it overlaps the text a little bit. Yeah. 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 That's nice. That works. It's beautiful. Yeah, Roddy, the interior designer. How am I supposed to fit all of these? That's cool. Put that over the words Carol Village, too. Actually, all right. hmm. No, too much no. over there. Okay. Place it kind of large on the other page, though. Like, right? Like, like this? Not that, not that <laughs> A little smaller. All right, I'll place it in the top uh, right corner of that page. Like here? Or you could place it down at the bottom of the page. Ah, like it's fine. Like, I like, like it's like... Uh, you can place the little fishes under the tree. Yeah. Uh, oh, I meant like perspective, kind of. You make yeah, it yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like this? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, let's that go. Cool. That looks so cool. It does. Oh, this was uh this was uh I hope she comes back and tells us it's safe to leave. That's terrifying. It really is. <laughs> uh I'll put it over here. A village that was created as a place to heal. Is that where my instinct to try to help comes from? It's so strange to imagine I'll be shaped by places and people I haven't met yet. So strange to imagine that I might feel at home somewhere else. New stamps and conclusion. Okay, so I can actually put the pictures in there. Uh, not the pictures, the, the text. Ah. <laughs> uh... These are decorations. Wait, what about the conclusion? Uh, I think I think that's it. I think I'm good. Okay. Yo, when did it turn dark? Oh, okay. <laughs> the sun <laughs> disappeared. <laughs> the first people, the first people to like live probably freak the fuck out. Probably. Yeah, that's much better. That looks way better, small. Yeah. There are so many steps. What do you do if you're in a wheelchair here? Yeah, have you seen Dr. Stone? Uh, no. Alright, so Dr. Stone is an anime about, um, pretty much something happens to where the world, like, the entire world, gets encased in stone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then there's, like, the one dude trying to figure it out, and I think he runs into, like, another person, right? Like, I, I know the premise, more or less, I just haven't watched it. So at one point in the show, they meet a little girl who, um, has a melon on her head. Mm-hmm. And it's shown that she's, like... Come to find out, she's blind. Okay. But the way, like, she has she has all, she has eye holes cut in the melon, and the way like being like nearsighted works is like because she's looking through the holes of the melon and they're like super close to her eyes. Mm -hmm. It kind of helps her vision a little bit. Oh, that's wild. Yeah. So it's like he ends up like making her some actual like glasses. Nice. But I bring that up to say like. People were pretty much like a lot of there were other people in that show who were like having hard of seeing, mm -hmm. and they were pretty much just kind of like pretending that they weren't. Mm. Like they would call it like the the fuzzy sickness. Mm. Cause you can't see. <laughs> <laughs> so so probably like that. They're so basically, like, they'll find the, a way. They're like, you have the no legs sickness. <laughs> no. I just I just wonder if like, cause it, there's a lot of steps here. Well, actually, there's not actually a lot of steps until you're about to leave. So maybe that maybe that's how they do it. People ain't leaving anyway, so it's not like they need a ramp. Yeah, they must use mountain water. Yes. Okay. 
How to leave home for my daughter. Find a sacred square of earth. Lay down so you have the dirt at your back. Close your eyes. Close everything. Do you see for yourself? You see for the dead, for the unborn. Do you listen for yourself? You listen for the dead, for the unborn. Your ancestors are in that dirt. All the living and all the dead are holding you up. Now stand. They're still there, aren't they? It's time to move, to entangle yourself everywhere with everyone. So the next time you lay down in the dirt, you will have so much more to tell them. Game is so good. What the fuck? No, for sure. It looks really good too, very cinematic. Yeah. They really popped off making this game. Yeah, they just live like way up in the mountains. Die? I'm sorry. <laughs> that was so much they go there. Huh? What's go up? Back. Can you die? Can, Can you I die? Go? Oh, let's find. No. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> oh, thank God. That just goes to show what my head is like. <laughs> I mean, as we started going, I was like, I hope I can't die. So, <laughs> same wavelength. Yeah. Oh, bikes. Hold on. I'll come back to that. Who's PNG tuber? Me? Or there, or, or, or Sesu. You know, I'm a bit of a diva. It might be. <laughs> Can I pick which one? Or is this one mine? Pate fixed up three bikes instead of one. Uh, we're gonna leave. Alright, um. While I like blue, we both are pink, so I feel like we have to pick yes. the pink one. Yes. Alright, now let's see what these bike controls are like. Ah. Okay. Oh, that's that's smooth. All right. God, I played this indie game once that also the main mechanic was riding a bike. The bike controls feel? were the worst. Ah, uh, these oh. are great. These are great. These are really good. I will say it looks like the bike is floating and not like moving in a weird way. A little bit. Yeah. Yeah, really does. <laughs> Like, it doesn't feel like the bike is attached to the ground, really. Yeah. Like I think that's okay. Oh, yeah. buddy, we gotta... Okay. <laughs> We're just... Oh, that's kind of cool. Like, you can, oh, okay. like, run... Oh! Oh, I accelerate... Oh, okay, okay. I didn't read. Oh, you can go pretty fast. Yeah. Okay. I was just fucking coasted and I got to a hill and I was like, wow, don't know what to do here. <laughs> Guess I'll get off. This game is so pretty. Oh, we zoom in. God, I have this hill. 
like in my city that I used to take for work when I used to bike. And um Why did I get off? <laughs> I'm just gonna get back on. Uh oh okay. Um It was a really long hill, which would have been great. Except uh it was one of those where like there's the bike lane, but also people kind of park like in it. So it's like, okay, you can go down the bike lane, but like, good luck. I am going to take a picture. That's pretty. Oh, you can take pictures of whatever you want now? Yeah. That's so cool. Let's see. Uh. No filter on this. This is too pretty. Do you take selfies? Uh, I don't think so. I can't like Fake. switch. <laughs> oh, okay. I'm taking uh, stuff around the path out of Cairo. Let's take a picture of this bridge. Uh. That's good. Uh, Lucas Range? No, 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 it was fine the way it was. Uh, zoom just a little. I guess let's take some audio. I don't think there's anything to take audio of. Ah, uh, the grass. Ah, oh, I counted it. The grass makes sounds? Yeah, when the wind goes through it. Uh, thanks for popping by. I hope you have a good rest of your day. Bye, Liz. There's only one path out of Cairo. These sights and sounds were so close to me all this time. I just needed to step out. Uh, let's see. Um, hi, Nico! How's it going? Happy Saturday! I hope you're having a good one. What did I just do? Okay. Thank you for the head pat. Oh, that's what I should have did. Okay. Okay. Now that I know where you sit, Ronnie, like on my screen, I'm gonna set up so you get head pats too. Hey. I'll do that for next time. I'm one of I'm more of a, a stompies kind of guy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm fucking weak. What is wrong with me? Bro? <laughs> <laughs> every time I say stuff, I'm like, I'm like, every day I stray further from God's light. <laughs> Alright, I'll take more pictures. That's sweet. Uh, take a picture of our bike. Our bike, yeah. Beautiful bike that Pate the fixed cart. up for Get the us. cart in it too, you know, like like foreground venue. Yeah, let's see. Uh, let me yeah. unzip. Yeah. Yeah. So beautiful. So beautiful. Putting in the bike over here. All right, we need one more for a conclusion. Or two. Uh, oh my God, <laughs> I forgot how to get on the bike. I'll figure it out. Nope. It's fine, <laughs> I'll run with the bike. Controls. What about get on bike? Alright, maybe I get on the bike when I'm good and ready to, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> maybe like A or something? I don't know. Yeah, I, I tried. Yeah, not this. This parks it. And this manipulates it. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Ooh. Ah, oh, hold on. Hold on, girl. 
It's a good... This is a good-ass view. There's so many mountains! Oh. Uh... Photography camera. Let's... no. Let's... Unzoom out as much as I can. Nah, that's too... too wild. Uh... No. Oh, you were good right where you were. Inspiration available. You can make the bike picture shorter and like place it on top of the picture of the tunnel. Oh yeah, I yeah. could. I feel nourished in these sites. You know, they don't have to be like gridded up, you know. Yeah. Of it all. These means of connection, long in disuse, can you are tell certainly that I don't telling turtle? me something about the world. <laughs> Will they be used again in the next season? Actually, I do journal one thing. I journal stickers. That's more than I do. <laughs> I get a lot of stickers from, like, fanzines and stuff. And, mm. like, I don't have anywhere to put them. <laughs> so I just have a, <laughs> a notebook for them. What is this? Postcards. Is an island. Fantasy island. I feel like I'm walking tipsy on the edge of the earth. We're skipping from island to island, the way a stone skips along the surface of the water, leaving little Speaking ripples. Of, what mm -hmm. I'm about to say is gonna make you laugh so hard. Are you ready? Yeah. They don't know what a fish is, but they know what alcohol is. <laughs> right. That's right. Crazy. I mean, I guess if they have, like, fruit-bearing trees, like, you could make alcohol. But, you know, you can't- you can't spawn a fish from a tree. Jesus, dude. <laughs> you're right, you're right. Doc Jesus. Dr. Fumio ain't that good, huh? He couldn't no, do that. Sure. Uh, I just miss you today, and today, and today. XOXO, you know who. I don't. I'm taking it though. Ooh, scary face. That, that mountain in the background is so fire. <laughs> I'm sorry, that's just real gothic. Like, it, it, oh, yeah, it kind of is. Cool. Yeah, I like the cows. Hey, guess where I am? I hope you looked at this side first. I didn't. I had to pay my respects to the birthplace of Manchez. There's a lot of tourists, but also a weird feeling to the place. It would take me more than a postcard to explain. Uh, this person has good stamps. I like the I like the lemur looking one. I like the monkey. <laughs> <laughs> I got his fucking zone down, man. <laughs> Holy shit. D don't bother trying to visit. It simply isn't that kind of location. Do we not let in outsiders? This village was very hard to find, but if you really need to, if you really need it, somehow you make your way there. I just wanted to let you know that I'm staying here for good. This season can only meet a violent end. It's too bright, too cheery. What the fuck? I can see in these letters that the outside world has extremes of beauty and tragedy beyond anything I've known. You ever feel like at the time we've been playing it, we're probably supposed to be farther than it? <laughs> probably. Well, you know, they say take it at your own pace. Yeah. Alright, I'm just gonna open this letter. Melody. Oh, I can't read that shit. Oh, fuck! You're right. The letter. No, 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 no. The season before this one. The war. The war? So horrible. 
Fucking, it's you know this shit about me. Hold on, hold on. I think I missed something important from this keepsake. Like you're, you're uh, you're fucking watching Adventure Time, and everything is like smells out and punch the Ice King, and then two seasons, it's war. Yeah, like, was it in like an apocalypse or something? Oh, hold on. I'm gonna make this really big so I can read it. I'll be surprised if this letter reaches you. The war has become like a deranged sleeper thrashing in bed, eyes closed tight. I've noticed how the soldiers strip people of their clothes first, a smaller degradation which permits everything that follows. I wish I had loved you more completely when the world allowed it. What I got from that was degradation kink. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, you were dead solid. I was so worried. I, it had to it had to like go through my mind. And then I was like, ah, I get it. The little versions of you in your head were like, where do we file this? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, this time I'm not just gonna pick it up, I'm gonna read it right. Please get this letter to Dr. Fumio. I am suffering from memory excess, but cannot travel to the village for treatment. I was praying you could instruct me by mail how to cure myself of this disease. I am unable to forget. Now I realize how important it is to gain open space in the mind. Tell me what to do. Tell me how to forget. Please get this letter to Dr. Fumio. Ah, uh, it didn't get to him. Before setting up in Karo Village, Dr. Fumio roamed the land curing people. It must have been hard when he wasn't around anymore, especially for people who couldn't travel to the village. Let's see. Uh, the fabric. Import, herbal tea, export, import, roots, export, dried flowers. Traders used to come to the outskirts of the village. The war put an end to this. Alright, that makes a little more sense, the war. Oh! Water! Cranes! Technology! Yeah, sketch it! Go for it, buddy! I can see why they didn't leave their village. Masterpiece. Better than what I could do. Uh... All right, time to get back on. Time to get back on my bike. Concert of eerily pitched Wait, howls. Hit the howls. Okay, okay. Let me get off. Ah, uh, yes, we see the first enemy. <laughs> Someone carve notches in the bamboo for the wind oh, okay. to kick through, so it can sing. The That's first cool. enemy, the environment. I'm not sure that episode of SpongeBob. Yeah, the yeah. The, Spon the stone SpongeBob. Mm hmm. Damn, you really zooming <laughs> down right now. Yeah, as soon as it started like getting hard, I was like, oh, let me stop. Let me just coast. I'm glad I can't fall off, because like I keep like looking everywhere. And I'm like, if I were on a bike, I'd be not alive. I'm letting the demons know where I am. You're gonna come at me, just come. This is interesting. 
Hopefully that's structurally intact. Don't you creak while I'm going under. You stop it. Let's accelerate faster, buddy. Oh. I want to read that sign. Hold on. Uh, guess I'll take a picture. I hit the wrong button for a picture. <laughs> there we go. I heard at some point the tides got less predictable. Places flooded that never had before. Okay, was it a war against people? Or a war against Mother Nature? <laughs> Mm. Um, Damn, you just got back on your bikes. <laughs> uh, let's see if I can ride through this. Oh, hell no. no. That's gonna be a problem. <laughs> oh, I can't just go. I can't even go that way. That's fine. That's fine. But let's see. Let's see. Froggy. Probably gotta go this way. Oh, up, up. Perfect. Exactly what I meant to do. You're so coordinated. Thank you. Sea land, transportation industries. Oh, this is older than the village. A crane to move materials around. The things that used to be possible. Y'all just not got technology anymore? What? Maybe it was a war where, like... Oops. The war, like... People got lazy, like, you know, like, one of those, like, robot apocalyptic type wars, mm -hmm. where, like, where people, like, bobbed each other. Right, right. Now, the only place that survives is, like, living in the sky, you know? Yeah. I'll leave you go not take a picture of the frog. I didn't even see the frog. Get the frog. Get the frog audio. Wait, hold on. I had to go back. I hope she knows what a frog is. Um... I forgot what I was going to say. <laughs> Me. <laughs> Maybe that's the enemies, what the fuck? No! <laughs> oh, take a picture, take a picture. Wait, wait, don't oh. go up to it. I'm gonna get a recording verse. We learned about old technology in school, but not much about animals. Okay, yeah, they ain't eating any meat. What are these strange goat-like creatures? Are they simply goats? Oh, wrong button. This one. Yeah, let's get a picture of this goat. Hey, put your head up. Yeah! I heard that village was abandoned because of a mind disease. Not every community had someone like Dr. Fumio to perform cures. Was that a village? I thought it was a goat. Can I pet the Is goat? Is the goat a village? I, I don't know. Oh, I can pet the goat. First time goat. petting an animal. Yes, let's go! Pretty well. If it was a pig, this would be a 10 out of 10 game. <laughs> We gotta pet all those animals. That's very important to me. Um, you know what? Okay, damn, this is why my brain goes to a dark place. Hmm? Take the goat back to the sky city. Eat the goat. <laughs> no! Mm, that time it felt off. I guess I had beginner's luck before. What? The goat didn't attack you, so I think you're good. <laughs> I mean, the problem is, once they get a taste for meat, and then they can't get it anymore. Okay, now I got it back. They'll become cannibals. <laughs> I can easily pet certain four-legged animals. Certain. Certain ones. They're, they're all goats. It really does imply that there are some animals that I can't pet. 
And I don't know. I don't know if it gets game of the year anymore with that. Yeah, go 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 pet that that lion. <laughs> I really did look. Oh, you looked for the Yeah. <laughs> That's terrifying. Wow, there's so many cranes. Freaking metal. Um this should be fine. Oh, you increase. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, nothing about that. That's fine. That's okay. Oh my god. Every time I get the bike and I start running with it, it reminds me of that stupid, like, 4chan green text where it's like, takes your bike and runs, and then it's like, at least ride it! Time I go under one of these, I'm scared there's gonna be like a quick time event. I cycled through landscapes, seeing them for the first and last time. I had no idea when I left my home how the season would end, or more importantly, how soon. On a cold, damp day, I feel true loneliness for the first time. Aww. Nobody could have described with words how big this world is, how it goes and goes. I passed through it, where others passed before me. Come on, buddy. We gotta get that generator, whatever it is. Windmills. Uh, take the, the blades turn, but I bet they don't generate any power. Probably just swirling the air around. Yeah, probably. It See definitely what? is terrifying. <laughs> I was scared. I was scared when you said that because you were like, "I see it," and I was like, "See what?" <laughs> uh, oh. why she'd be lonely. Is that a highway? Hold on. You know what that is? What the fuck is it? It looks like a highway. They really hitting us with this post-apocalyptic shit. <laughs> really though. Its structure dominates the landscape, but wasn't made for it. It's for passing through, for moving elsewhere. Oh yeah, that's a highway. Oh my god. Oh. Okay. How about this? Okay. 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 Okay, so please take, make the tape very big. Very big. Not that big. <laughs> it was All right, now we'll place it on the other page. Yep. Down a little bit. Yep. 
down a little bit. Yep. More. Yep. More. And then yep. move it to the right. Wait, move it up slightly. Then move it to the right. Right a little bit more. Yeah. Okay. That way it kind of looks like a like a part of the page, you know? Yeah, it does. I, I hit the wrong buttons. Um. Oh, draw. Oh, wait. It was cool where it was actually kind of. Over here? Like on top of the tape. Go down a little bit. Oh, up a little bit. Yep. Over to the right a little bit. Yep. Yeah, that looks cool. Yeah. Let me show you this one. You know, since the, you have like two of them, what we can do is make them small. Mm hmm And then place, wait, not that small though, a little bigger. <laughs> uh, up a little bit. Yep. Can you rotate them slightly? Uh, yep. A little more. Now place that one. Yep, like right here? Yeah, that's cool. Okay. I'll grab the next one. I'm gonna do like a thing, we're gonna make them the same size. Mm -hmm. and. I was gonna place them right next to each other, so they're kind of like in a collage. Uh, but place, but make this one turn the other way, though. Yeah, I'm just making sure it's the same size. Okay. Like this. I'll place it like over down, over to the right a little bit. Over the right a little bit. Down a little bit. Yep. Over to the right a little more. Mhm. Mm right there, perfect. Boom. Okay. And then we place the last one in an opposite pattern again. I'm doing this shit like this shit really. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be cool actually, make it a little make it the same size as the other ones. Yeah. Let me. Uh, a little bit. Okay. A little bit smaller. Okay. Like this? Yeah, that'd be cool. That yeah. Looks cool. That's so cool. Time seems yeah. to pass differently around here. I feel so heavy and so light. Like that picture so looks like it's a part of the tape photo. You know? It really does, yeah. I'm with myself. I'm with the earth. Oh, I can't be alone with my thoughts for this long. She's brave. She's brave <laughs> as hell. I'm gonna put this somewhere. Maybe, maybe over here. Maybe here. Maybe here. Let's try that. I'm not gonna put any of that other stuff in though. Ah. Hmm. Nah. Alright, buddy. Yeah, we ain't got no jacket, no umbrella. We're gonna get sick. The only sickness is the forgetting sickness. I guess. It doesn't seem like people get any other sickness in this world. Yeah. Hold on. Atmosphere. Oh. Every line is dead. Every wire is cut. I hate this season. Damn. Pull out and take a picture of the whole thing. Yeah. Not just the... Yeah. I yeah, didn't remember fire. I had to pull out. <laughs> Someone was out here alone. Like us? We're out here alone. There we go.
Somehow this reminds me I need to practice piano today. <laughs> <laughs> I think it still works, it's crazy. Yeah! One melody is like me out here alone. I can't really live like this. What do you mean it's locked? Oh. I think I couldn't pick it up while she was talking. One voice. One tune. Alone in the wilderness can't last long. Two voices. A melody and a harmony is enough to survive for a little while. Three voices. A community. A song. Can last a whole season. Gotta take that. They kept themselves company with music. Oh, another. Well, that's the same two. Two voices is like me and my mom. We can survive, but eventually you need more. Did you uh, record the audio from it? Yeah, let's oh, do okay. it. Yes, don't put the mic directly at it. What's that? Put it right up close? Okay. Got it. That would be kind of cool, but what? people might abuse the fuck out of it. If like it took audio from like the mic on your controller or something. Oh. Three voices as complex as life is supposed to be. Loud. I could listen forever. I'm about to make Take a cacophony of sound. Oh, I can't. Oh God. Hold oh on. god. Don't We're do doing this. it. <laughs> We're doing it. You're welcome. As you can I see, I'm to running. Unlock those. Uh huh. Are you? Aren't you supposed to un unlock those? <laughs> no, I don't think so. I think they locked while I was talk, like while she was uh, talking. Cause oh. they're like, you can't pick this up right now. This is a monologue. Hi, Beetel. How are you? Yeah, we picked the pink bike because we were like, we're pink, so we might as well pick the pink bike. Yes. There was also a yellow bike, so if you ever play this game, Beetle, that's your bike. Do you think that they did that for like boy, girl, and like in between is yellow? Maybe. Because blue, pink, and yellow seem very specific. It really does, yeah. I met a driver from a group that's building a community. I'm leaving with him. Goodbye to this lonesome place. Goodbye to this lonesome season. So, can you imagine that they wrote this and then also drew the truck? But what is this group? And that guy was probably like, can you hurry up? Like, I wanna fucking sit down. Like yeah! Yeah, it's been a nice sound. I recorded it for you. Uh, I'll also take a picture of this. Me. No. <laughs> Let me zoom out. Right here, I think. We also met some goats. That we got to pet. So, you know, top tier game. Oh! Tiang Valley! I remember that one.
In the empty places, I found companionship in the tapes I recorded before leaving home. Oh, good. The elder told me the story of her life. I listened back to it. Ready to note down. Not enough phones is way too nice. <laughs> she got the fucking Apple. <laughs> <laughs> the Apple, the fucking Apple AirPods Max is the Yeah, those are the fucking, like, kind of stuff that, like, audio files are going to be using. Dead ass, bro. <laughs> they got a, that's like, you know it is, because they got, like, a, it's a headphone, but they got, like, a leather strap on the Yeah! <laughs> Whoever that might be. This is the Elder speaking. We're sitting in the plaza, saying goodbye to a dear soul. We're here to see Sounds if there's ominous. anything useful in my mind that could help you on your trip. A century's worth of memories, dreams, fantasies, visions. Like a big, old, haunted library. When I die, this library will burn down. But which book what? can we check out first? <laughs> Yo, what? <laughs> it was so random. <laughs> I mean, you know, the library for mine. I don't have all the answers, but I oh, can feel the story of my life. That's what she meant. Like that's yeah, kind of right. World is out there. Do you have any advice? Any other advice for my trip? It's okay not to understand everything right away. The moment may pass before you've gotten a firm hold on it, but as long as you're there to witness it, to take it down in your journal, you and others to come. Will someday take the time to make sense of it all. Uh, what do you want to ask? Oh. Uh, how did you become the elder? Yeah. First, I got old. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> of course. Of course. It's all about how you react to strange events. The key okay. is not to be surprised, but kind of frown. Look serious. <laughs> and say something like, yes. It begins. <laughs> Why'd you get the job? She's like, she's like, yes, being an elder just means being like, the wind moves in strange ways. Yeah. Never say, I don't know. Honestly? Advice to live by. Yeah. Say. Never say I don't dive know. Dive into a pool of uncertainty. Yo, that's some. <laughs> bro. I would say, ah, how curious. The gods must be testing us. That's it. I was born on the ocean. Oh, so you know what a fish is. My mother and father worked on a cruise uh. ship. What? Okay, so y'all had ships back then. A short lived but glorious. Watery republics. What? Did they have white privilege back then. Yeah. Floating cities. Most won their independence by the time I was born. Oh. How can I describe them? They were a jewel of the golden season. Mm. Pleasure boats with a radical political program. How nice. So were they like uh like how trains used to be when they were like really souped up and cool and now they're just boring? Yeah. yeah. The golden age was a time of flags, logos, mottos, mastheads. My mom taught me to read them. She was a ship's philosopher. My dad was a recycling engineer. Oh, okay, cool. Recycling on the ship was a matter of life and death. Yeah, yeah an important job. We had to get the most out of every object and watt of energy. Mm. Mm. Tell me about your mom. No, tell me. Mm. Damn, we only get to ask one of these. I know. Where did your family come from? All right. My grandparents played with the past. What does that what? mean? What does that mean? They changed it like we change our wardrobe. Oh, so they just yeah. didn't tell you the right thing. So it was a different answer every time. Uh. Fair enough. But they often said we are exiles of some kind. Is she Jewish? Exiled royalty uh, from a secret I don't know. Lineage. Blood mm. glows in the dark. What that glows what? in the dark? What the fuck? She's a xenomorph. 
emperor exiled from the mouth of some great leviathan. Oh, okay, okay. These are all the answers that you were given. When they were older, they just said, we're from here. We're from right now. I'd be like, Grandpa, come on. Uh, what was it like growing up there? I loved the way the ship would tilt and roll with the waves. Especially as I fell asleep. It was so comforting. I wouldn't be able to do that. Picture me as a kid in bed, feeling the swaying of the ship. It was like I'll be fucking sick to my stomach. Right? I loved exploring the ship too. Wandering through the suites, the swimming pool, the game rooms, and oh, there were two dance halls. Ooh. A large, elegant one and another one in the basement. Okay, but that one was probably the one that was, like, cool. A lot of my firsts were down there. Yeah, for sure. Dance, my first kiss, and so forth. And, and so forth. Ma'am? When did you leave the ship? Our ship was taken over in the early days of the war. That was the end of the watery republics. I heard the dance hall in the basement became a weapons cache. Ah, oh, that sucks. It took me half my life to say goodbye to the world I knew in my youth. Imagine me and my parents and everyone I knew being escorted off the ship by a company of soldiers. And I'm thinking, I hope they don't make a mess of my room. <laughs> you weren't getting back I to that room, buddy. I was by the younger kids who were crying their eyes out. But they knew, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> no, for sure. Yeah. Uh, which one do you want to ask? Uh, at the end of a season. Yeah. Yes, the start of the war was a turning of seasons. And we had been warned the season was going to end. Oh, but we didn't understand the warning. You see, one night, along a coastline, we saw beautiful lights shimmering above the water. Later, we found out this was an ancient warning system. What? It hadn't been used in so long. We didn't know what it meant. We just thought, well, ain't that pretty. We tried to stick together and camped out on the coast of the prismatic grounds. Um, I kind of want to know what the fuck the prismatic grounds are. Yeah. A kingdom of art and science. Oh. They got rich during the golden season. Everything that made them beloved before the wealth came. Passionate, mm. uncompromising, self-obsessed. Made them unbearable once they had power. Mm, yeah, I could feel it. Artists make mm. terrible kings. <laughs> <laughs> I kind of like that. I wanna, I'm want i going to keep that. I like that quote. What yeah. The, that's so fire. That's such a good quote. Artists make terrible kings. Jesus Christ. Right. Are you sure you want me to keep going? The story gets darker from here on. Yes. Uh, what? <laughs> no, 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 no. I, okay, I need so this, please, ma'am. Conditions in the camp were getting worse. This I is a camp. I lost in thought for <laughs> long periods of time. It's a... Yeah. This might be an, been an internment camp. She'd be completely Ooh. still for hours. Maybe. Days even. Well, they made camp. This reminds me a lot of um, Night by Ellie Wiesel, if you've read, if you read that. Uh, sounds vaguely familiar, but I'm not sure. About a young boy and his father who got split up from his mom and his sister mm -hmm. in, a, in a Jewish internment camp. And he had to, like, his father, like, slowly deteriorated because he didn't have no food. And at the end... He had to, like, leave his father behind. No! Yeah, it was bad. Like, he started to, like, resent how weak and, like, like sickly his father had gotten. Like, Fuck. it was crazy. Yeah, it was it's fucked. But that shit really happened. Like, that's based on a true story. Like, that yeah. really happened to the... All right, back to the actual dark story. <laughs> the other dark story. <laughs> Well, now we call it time misperception disorder. It's when you lose your ability to tell how much time is passing. Huh. A minute can feel like an hour. A day can pass in ten seconds. 
I mean, that just feels like COVID times, really. Uh, how would she know how she caught it? But how um, did it make her feel? I don't know. Which one should I pick? How did she catch it? All right. Actually, how did she? We don't oh. know exactly. She <laughs> already clicked it. Yeah, I figured that's what she just said. Yeah. There are minerals and sounds that can adjust it. Dr. Fumio's greatest fear was that someone would use this as a weapon. We heard about a traveling doctor who could cure these kinds of diseases. Mm. I decided to go find him. Oh, that's right. There was a mural about, um, like her trying to cure her mother uh, of the oh. time misperception disease. And so she went and found him. I found out his oh, name okay. was Dr. Fumio and he traveled with his son, Lucio. People talked about him like he was a god. Uh, which one? Uh, I feel like we know what happened when he found them. Yeah. But, like, hmm. Oh. What was going on with the war? Yeah, I'm really curious about the that. The prismatic grounds had roped almost everyone into their system until they reached the far wastes and heard no for the first time. Nobody reacted well. Oop. It got to the point of, you know, neighborhood against neighborhood. Grievances had been buried so deeply we forgot they were there. It felt like things changed overnight. I'd pass through a city and hear later that they torn each other apart. Jesus Christ. I could not imagine it. Uh, oh, okay. Nice. I described my mom's condition to Dr. Fumio. He said there was no cure yet, but there was a village high in the mountains. He thought it was high enough he'd have a better chance at treatment. Lower places are more dangerous. Valleys are the worst. Hmm. He invited me to join them in going to the village. But I wanted to go back and get my parents and bring them with me. Uh... It gets fucking rough. I think village high in the mountains, because then we can ask what happened next. After, I feel like, because that's an integral part of the... the yeah, the, like, the that's what I think, team. too. Yes, our Carroll village. People thought it had been destroyed, or was a myth. But Lucio had a vision which showed us how to get here. Oh, the kid. Oh. I packed my things and got ready to leave the next morning. That night, my mom came to me in a dream. She was standing in a field of flowers. I'd grown since I last saw her. We were the same height. She pressed a finger hard into my palm. She taught me well. I knew the meaning of the gesture. I knew no matter what I did, I'd never see my parents again. Aww. In the morning, I told Dr. Fumio I would follow him to Carroll Village. The next few weeks were very physically tiring, hiking, climbing. And when we found the village, building, planting, cleaning, Fumio brought sick people from all over the world, and they got better. The treatments worked. Everyone was healing. So why couldn't I? One day, we got word the war was over. We never found out how it ended. It was like peace just swept over the earth in a split second. There was a party in the plaza to celebrate the end of the war, but I couldn't bring myself to go. Yes, it was over, but it had taken my home, my family. That night, as I was falling asleep, I felt the bed tilt and sway gently, as if it was being tossed on the waves of the ocean, as if I was back in my bedroom on the ship, as if I was back in my mother's arms, being rocked gently to sleep. I knew I was finally home. Aww. And nothing could hurt me. Oh. Right?
I imagine coming upon a place as hidden and singular as my own village. Eventually, I found myself circling a valley, looking for a way in. All right, let's oh, they go. Say valleys. They say valleys are the most dangerous. dangerous. Yeah. It's okay though, we got our pendant. Our pendant? <laughs> our pendant. We'll be fine. Damn. Hey, do I walk through the valley of the shadow of death? <laughs> uh. Hey, hey, Sessu. Yeah. Damn. What? It, it's, a, it's a dam. Oh! <laughs> I get it. I get it. Uh, which side do I want to take a picture from? I can't see shit over there. picture of what? I don't know. Uh. Sorry, that was me. Huh? Maybe get closer to it and take a picture? Yeah. Nah, it's fine. They took it. No, I'll get closer. One of these days, I'll get it right the first time. Uh, yeah, my bike can be in it. It's fun. Is, is this the generator? Oh. A gift from the Prismic Grounds. The Electric Peace Project, year of 515. We never used this kind of technology in my village. Nobody trusted it. Y'all don't trust electricity? How y'all keeping this going? Wow. Magic. It's still working. <laughs> it's still delivering power somewhere. Oh, you know how that goes. Yeah. I mean, maybe it's like a, maybe it's like a hand crank. What the fool is hand cranking it? <laughs> I don't know. How else is it working? Well, they don't trust electricity. Maybe they got batteries? That's still electricity. It's foggy as hell. What the fuck? Oh! I was not expecting a a gate. Oh, but it says no entry. Hold on, come on, bike. Oh, hey, this is the truck from that. Uh, from the from the from the. I'm leaving this place. I found a guy with the truck. <laughs> and actually, it's still powered too. Yeah. It's kind of wild. I'm assuming, I'm assuming this is where the group must be a car, but it looks weird. Loop. Yeah, I haven't seen one like this in my books. Oh wow! I'm glad I took that where I did. Yeah. See. Oh. The uh, valley. Um. W one second. Take a picture of this whole thing, this whole no-entry place with the guy in the middle. Uh, I can't go any further. Oh my god. Uh, is this good? Yes, wait, get the no-entry sign a little bit, like turn to the... Yeah, yeah. Like that?
The elders said that people were exhausted by symbols after the war. But here are a few hanging. Oh! Hey, hey buddy. Is that a Strodo uh, yeah, what, what are they called? A camera? Camera nigga? <laughs> 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 uh. You are 13? Yeah. I love old gear like that. It's getting more and more rare. I, I had a camera, but it broke. Oh. Not that interesting of a story, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> I appreciate that you wanted to share it with us, though. That was yeah, cute. yeah. What are you doing here? Um. Maybe uh, observe I'm here to observe and record yeah. the world. I thought about experience the moment, but then I was like, what's that going to sound like to other people? The whole thing, huh? <laughs> yeah, the You're whole young. thing. You, you got time. <laughs> what kind of stuff are you recording? Uh, um, hopefully people in their culture. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Civilization, they call it. The valley would be a good place to use those tools. But? Too bad it's closed down. Why? Let me finish up here, huh? Why is the valley closed? What are you doing? Here stands the gateway to Tian Valley, home of the three mindful gods. As you enter, try to imagine the millions of pilgrims who passed under this gate before. They were born, they lived, and they died. I'm not the first to do this. Just the first in a long time. Hey! What? Sir? This was like a second home for a while. That was fun earlier when you showed up. And I was I'm still here. the cardboard man. I, I'm still here. You were like, who are these guys? <laughs> <laughs> I don't think this man talked to another person in a while. Yeah, it's funny though, it's cute. I've been pretty yeah. bored here. You know, the valley's gonna be flooded soon. Oh! That's why I still think can go in there. Yeah. The dam is falling apart. Uh. What's wrong with the dam? It's too old. There's nobody left who knows how to repair it. Yeah. We're taking it down so we'll know when it'll collapse. Okay. It gives us time to evacuate everyone. We. Who's we? You be you? Greyhound. We're a community organization. Oh. We do all kinds of fun stuff. Health clinics, mine sweeping, daycare, evacuations, weddings. Weddings. We're new. Mine sweeping is crazy. Yeah. What is gray hand supposed to mean? Yeah. It was supposed to be because we're helpful yet neutral. Oh, okay. We took a vote and decided to change the name, though. We want something more friendly sounding. I'm excited to find out what it would be. We're trying to get new things going. But it's hard. The past really has a tight grip on people. Doesn't feel like a fair fight. So we're trying to... It could be like the open hand. Yeah. yeah. That's nice. Anyway. It's funny. I stood guard here for a week. And I've only seen gray hands like myself. And valley people on their way out. But now I see you, and you're like a... new element, or something. New I've element. never met anyone yeah. doing what you're doing. And uh, we Greyhands gotta support new things. So... Hmm. I'm not supposed to let anyone in. How can I? Jeez. I think you should go down into the valley and take a look. <laughs> Not supposed to let anyone in, but uh, you should go. Yeah. It's closing. Oh, okay. 
Or maybe he's closing his eyes so that way he wouldn't see me. Dang it. I was trying to wake up. <laughs> oh. What? <laughs> oh no, oh. I love him. He's great. You get the idea. Go on and put that old gear to use. You can take my map of the valley too. I don't need it anymore. Oh. It's funny, it's like... I'll be down I don't know, to a certain point, it's like, it's sweet that he's so nice. Mm -hmm. But like... I don't know, don't you feel like... Okay, so the thing with silent protagonists to me is like... People are so nice to them when they barely say anything. Yeah! <laughs> like, he was so nice to us, and we were just like... Yeah. Cool. <laughs> I met like, a great thanks. Hand. He let me into the valley. I think he wanted me to record what the Grey Hands were up to. And he gave me a map. Oh, cool. The assembly point seemed like a good place to start. The assembly points. Okay. Okay, I see. Gotcha. I wonder what he expects me to discover in the valley. Yeah, look at this first. The entrance to Tian Valley Shrine. The Tian Valley Shrine is only open to visitors when the sun rises and when it sets. Visitors wake early to see the morning ceremonies, and they come back at night to witness the ceremonies that bring an end to the day. How the fuck can you read that? Ah. Uh... That shit is so light. <laughs> it seems like I'll have to wait for night to enter the shrine. Ah, uh, I wear glasses. <laughs> Please respect the residents of the Tian Valley. They're not actors or tourist guides or animals, but hardworking folk. Please collect all trash or debris from the concessionary stands before leaving. This garbage not only clutters the pristine valley, but is offensive to the local people. Do not eat- Oh, uh, sorry. To the local people who do not eat mass-produced food or drink. I'll think about what kind of visitor I want to be. Okay, so they just living off the land then. Uh, oh, before we continue, though. Let me put in some keepsakes. Uh, the black and white ones first. Yeah. That's cool. Um, put it down, uh, put it down a little bit. Yeah. 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 I wonder if I can make it bigger. No. Yeah. Oh, I like yeah? it bigger, actually. Okay. Yeah, that's good. Uh, let's see. What is... The hum of the power being generated. Um... I Which think placing it against the bottom is cool. Like the, the, the other. Alright. Yeah. Yeah, a little. Th yeah. Yeah. Uh, exactly. Yeah. Alright. Um. I'll put both of these in. Maybe here? Maybe here? Huh. It's fine if you want to look a little bit. Uh, and then probably the postcard. Hmm. Maybe like here. The elder warned me about valleys. She said they were dangerous. I feel a dulcet tension in the air. I enter to see the moment between seasons. All right, what we get from that? I like this one. There we go. Alright, let's get our bike. This bike is so good. It's like a good bike. And it was just laid out there. Right. Well, um, our friend fixed them up. But still. I 
I have, like, a bike with an old frame. Um, it used to be, like... I guess a bike similar to this. Um, the problem is I can't put, like, a back thing on it. Um, because it's either have a rain guard or have a back, like, thing. You can't have both. Ah, uh, okay. What is a rain guard? Um, like, like, uh, like, on the, on the bike there. Um, except, like, it's just a little, it flares out a little. So that way, like, you know, when it rains and the, uh, the wheels catch the water, that it doesn't, like, splash on you. Oh, okay. Yeah. It's beautiful as fuck with that health. Um, okay. Breath of the Wild. Yeah, though. Oh my god, what I was just- What is she eating? What is she eating? What is she you know? eating? Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> she- she like, taking bark off trees? Bro. <laughs> There's no fucking way that she's not eating <laughs> I just- what else could she be eating? She's eating animals. She didn't know what an animal was until she ran into it. And if she was eating an animal, she saw that goat, she would knew it was meal time. Yeah. Remember, you made it here. But me- we- we made here. Wow. I am probably the last person That's... that will ever be welcomed here. There was some racism time. undertones to that. <laughs> Gonna show this to the village so they all go like, what the fuck? Here we go. Yeah. This very path you stand on has been the same since at least year 350. Imagine millions of pilgrims walking this humble path to visit the famous Tien Valley Shrine. The Elder told me there is very little information about the years before 500. That's wild. What are these signs? Behold the ceremony of the random, of random dead. death is crazy. A person is selected arbitrarily from the graveyard. A monk unearths memories of this person for all to enjoy. Every first Saturday of the month, surprise at the Tien Valley Cemetery. Surprise! God. I I've wondered about the lives beneath unkept graves. Imagine being like in the afterlife, seeing that happen and going. Bitch, I kept those memories safe for a reason. What are you doing? <laughs> the memories of me being like a serial killer or something. Like, come on. Uh, hold on. Uh, let me look at the map. I think I need to go that way first. Does this show where you're at on the map? No. What the fuck? I remember it, um... It showed where we were on, like, that bus bit. Oh. I'm just kind of assuming I'm going the right way. Serene Pond... Okay. Is the game freaking out for you? Um... No, not really. Like, the screen was shaking a little bit. Oh, I think that's because I was stopping. Oh. All right, Serene pa Oh! Oh! I get it. All right. So we're like... We're like to the left of that pond, I think. All right. 
guess I'm gonna go down there. Yeah, I was gonna say, I think you need to ride the bike down. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> At first I was just gonna take a picture, but I was like, nah, nah, I need to go down there. The, sa the sound of soldiers speaking. Sounds dangerous. It does sound dangerous. Yo, why is the... Why is the screen wobbly? You see it too now, right? Yeah. Wait, maybe you're getting sickness. Wait, wait. Oh, maybe. <laughs> Hungry eyes and empty stomachs. Look, artists. These metal animals are looking up expectantly. Animals. Oh, that's cool as hell. Oh, you're like feeling the memory. Yeah. Take your thing out, yeah. Oh, I can't hear shit. Oh. Um, no. Oh, wait, no, it shows where the, the warriors are speaking at. Look at the arrows next to it. Oh, okay, okay. Oh! Like over there, maybe. That's who Gothlet says hi. Hi, Gothlet. I hope he's having a good day. Oh, is it coming from this flower? Yeah. I'm about to go back in time and beat up those dudes. <laughs> he definitely looks like she could fight. <laughs> yeah. It's kind of wild. Oh, hold on. I have a page. Yeah, I have a page for the area. I think I'm gonna need more keepsakes. Or what you could do, mm -hmm. grab it again. Yep. Make it, oh, make it like extra large. Extra maybe? large, yep. I kind of like the motif of it like going over the, the photo a little bit. Like this? Maybe not that big, but like a uh, little smaller. Like a little smaller. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's cool. Okay. Let's do it. I heard gunshots last night. That was us. <laughs> what is that? Look at the pond. The I don't want to hear those dudes. Um. Assholes. Yeah. I feel like it's going to be the end of the game before I actually remember which button does what. <laughs> Pretty complex scheme, though, you know? Yeah. Um. I'll come back for you, bike. No, she won't. You've been abandoned. No! Like all the other tools of old. No! <laughs> this flower has a shimmering quality. Oh, sorry. I'll take a picture of the the flat. Oh no, you're good. You got it. <laughs> that shit is really affecting you, Jesus Christ. 
cheap, right? A green space. I feel memory in the air like pollen. It reminds me of a poem my dad was never able to finish. The first line was, If you want to awaken the dead, just whisper. Wild. Alright, we're moving, we're moving away from this. to cry out in the wilderness not even be human Bro, you're asking too many scary questions real existential oh the frame rate is dropping Wait, yeah okay, it really you. is what's the game <laughs> settings uh video settings maybe uh shadow quality low yeah maybe Uh, I think that should be fine. Yeah. What if I didn't? Oh, okay. It's plenty beautiful without medium shadows. Yeah. Shadows tend to be the things in these games that, like, really affect performance. Yeah. Okay, I think. I think that's the assembly point. Or at least close to it. Yeah, close. I want soda pop. Or some Cheetos. <laughs> I don't think they got either of them. Let's go. Uh, Bro, the Cheetos that would be in that machine would be so fucking old. Yeah, oh my god. Drink a soda that was in an old ass machine. <laughs> okay, I don't think I can go that Oh, yeah, I can. Buddy. Yeah, let's just run through here. Oh, let's go over here, actually. Sign up for the for the gray hand. There must be a lot of people going to the city if they need to keep track of them with cards. Gray hands are evacuating people to Radiant City. Oh, gather around the gray hand. I see, I see. Imagine if the man I met is the only living gray hand, and the rest are cardboard. Girl, can you be quiet? That's scary. That's fucking terrifying. I like, what is your disposition oh, for saying free. fucking terrifying things? In progress. <laughs> right! Oh, they got chips! Oh, shit! Cheetos! Lots on a new season. A manifesto for the future. Everybody knows something is wrong, but nobody knows what to do. Everyone you meet is paddling aimlessly through grief. Everyone you meet Jesus is in Christ. mourning, right? <laughs> Jesus Christ. Because the last season left behind a beautiful corpse. It is time to bury it and move on. You say, It is not so simple! Yes, but the walls that surround us are not as thick as they appear. One of these walls may even be a door. We will summon a moment of psychosis. A moment when we forget that we can't walk through walls. And so we will. We will walk through a wall. 
What kind of season is on the other side? No one knows, because we haven't built it yet. Join us. Wow. Man. I'm used to fucking, like, end this season. join us, because we're cool. Grey hands have plans for a better future. Debatable. Yeah. No. Nah, not sure. <laughs> Listen, you think they know what you think they know what this shit is back at home? I don't think so. Potato chips. Yeah, I don't think they know. These snacks are so identical, as if See? they were mass produced. They are. They the are. Snacks of my life have been homespun. Idiocentric, even. Yeah, they left trash. Uh, yeah, mm. let's play the side girl. Ah, this is the assembly point. We have no leader. Doing it right this time. We will never wage war. Those nukes look real ominous. <laughs> right? See the world it's like for the first time. We will hold hands for the right amount of time. Not too brief, not forever. <laughs> <laughs> we will build the next season. Seems like propaganda. They say they're going to build the next season. How? Oh. Inspiration available. I kind of forgot I was doing that here. <laughs> yep. I just- I just drew him? When? The gray hands are the future in all its uncertainty. The good and the bad. The hope and fear of progress. The loneliness of this season will be left behind. A collective project is coming. Oh, that's a cute little page, actually. Yeah. Okay, this is what I would do. Can you change it? Uh, I can't take credit for it, but I think I can change it. Uh, okay, what I would do is take the take the little city on the on the on the right. Uh huh. You can't move, move it. And move it down. You can't. Actually, I can't do anything now. Wow. Okay. Yeah, that's fine then. Fuck it. <laughs> uh, how did I get here? Wanna take the audio from the electrical lamp? Ah, yeah, let's do it. Oh. Not that one, I guess. Is it not this one? Let's see. I think we have bugs in the mountains. No, I'll say that it was the other one. Yeah, it is that one, because you see it's changing location now depending on your camera, so it is this one. Okay. See, there are way more bugs around this one. We were at assembly point. I guess we'll figure out where to go next. Oh my god. There we go. I'm not even mad at like the controls. I'm mad at myself. What? Oh. <laughs> is that not creepy? Yeah, it is. I wouldn't answer that. <laughs> I flew around it. Wait. Oh, 
Wait. Wait. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Wait. Now you're nervous? You were the only <laughs> one who wasn't nervous. What? I loved that about you. Why y'all? Who are you I calling? Because I lost some day zero materials. I don't like those materials just sitting around. Take it easy. I'm not gonna take it easy just because you're used to me taking it easy. All right, fine. Mode. <laughs> Where did you last have it? I think I left it at the dig site. I remember setting it on that barrel. The one you put a sticker on, the, the little fruit sticker. Don't cry. Uh -huh. I'm not. Look at me. Listen, the flood will take care of it. Oh, right. That's the beauty of a flood, okay? It's just gonna wash it all away. See? It's okay. Hey, why is the phone off the hook? Why is the phone off the hook? It's calling Tiang Valley. I was why? hoping Poros hadn't left yet and he could get it for me. I don't hear any ringing. The line must be dead. Oh. Uh, power generator. Hmm. I like that. I wish I could like write in here, cause I would just put like question marks underneath this. <laughs> like, what the fuck is this? Uh, I hope we can pick those up from the dig site. Yeah, I feel like they wouldn't make it a, like a thing that you could grab if you couldn't. Well, like they wouldn't tell you about it, rather. Right, right, if I couldn't grab it, yeah. I just have to remember it. The process of taking people out of the valley was also a kind of ritual, a way of bridging one life to another. They know the world they're leaving. The next one hasn't been created yet. Mm. One day. One day, one day, one day. There we go. How are you feeling? You want to keep going or? Um, oh, that jump was crazy. This might be a good time to stop, actually. Yeah, that's what I was going to yeah. say. Oh my god. It would be a good time to stop if I press the right buttons. Oh, there's a oh, retreat bicycle. That's, yeah, oh. that's, that's, I don't feel like that's a bad sign, actually. <laughs> <laughs> like, that's a bad omen. <laughs> Yeah, mental checkpoint. Yes. All right. Thanks for hanging out with us, y'all. It was a lot of fun. Hold on, let me let me change my screen to like my just chatting screen. And let me see where it's going to put you. I don't know where it's going to put you. Okay, let me watch. Oh, there you are. I'm going to put you I oh. to switch over for me. Oh, it just <laughs> <laughs> It just put me in that air. Yeah, cool. hold on, hold on. I'm gonna put you. I'm gonna put you in this chair, kinda. I'm just gonna put you here. There you go. <laughs> Beetle said it looks like you're just <laughs> looking at me. On the <laughs> it's okay. Now it looks like you're kind of on the ground, and I'm, I'm over here. Like I don't know. <laughs> Oh man, this was a lot of fun. Thanks for hanging out with me and doing this. Of course, you know, anytime. You know, yeah. you're always welcome. You're always welcome on my side as well, you know? Yeah, I, I think we are doing that, right? In like. Yeah, we are. In yeah. Like, in, in like a week or so. Yeah, I think so. So yeah, if you. If you guys are interested, don't feel free to, to come to my side and follow the boy, you know? Yeah! But, we're gonna have Kasesu over on that side. We're gonna do some some coffee talk, you know. A lot of coffee opinions will be said as well, probably. Yeah. 
He's also very chill and has chill streams, so I recommend them. Yeah, I appreciate that. That means a lot. You know, some people, some people act like I'm excitable. <laughs> I don't know what they're talking about, you know? <laughs> But yes, it was really, I really appreciate you having me. I had a really good time. Um, you better have right coffee opinions. Now, now you know, now, now you gotta stand on that. Now you really gotta stand on that. <laughs> Do you drink your coffee black? Because if you drink your coffee black, I don't want to hear you say nothing to me. <laughs> I don't, I don't drink coffee actually. At all? Oh wait, but you, hmm. Okay, you even, reason? even before stomach issues, I didn't drink coffee. Um, I think I tried it, like, in college once, and for some reason I had it in my head that, like, I should learn how to drink this black just in case, so, like, I, I can do it, but it, it hurts yeah, my stomach in a not-stomach issue way. Uh, the way I feel about coffee is, it's kind of how I feel about alcohol, because I, I don't know drink, so it's like, I use it, people, I feel like people drink it for the effect and act like they like the taste. Mm-hmm. Oh yes, I agree with Beetle. I love like milky, sweet, sugary coffee. I do not want my coffee to taste like coffee at all. Right, right. Yeah, because it's just like it's bitter and not it's it's not tasty. <laughs> yeah, when people say that they that they like coffee, I'm like, yeah, I like coffee. I'm like, yeah, drink your dirty bean water. <laughs> since, since that's what you like. Exactly. I'm just gonna drink my dirty leaf water instead. They're so based. I love to drink a good taste. Exactly. Exactly. I don't want to drink something that tastes bad. What the fuck? Yeah. Is, especially because a lot of people, coffee, the effects of coffee don't even work. Especially me, like, to get, like, up and at them, I, I had to, like, drink a Red Bull before we started. Cause <laughs> I was so tired. Yeah. Um, coffee doesn't work for me either. And um, I don't even think, like, energy drinks work for me. Like... I used to, I used, to, I tried an energy drink once. It was like a, it was like a coffee-based energy drink, and wow. um, I immediately fell asleep. <laughs> it did not work. <laughs> nah, yeah. Sometimes your body is so tired that like, you know, like I think that's like that's how diabetes works. You know, like, mm -hmm. like your body, especially like for type two diabetics, it's like you you put so much sugar in your body your body isn't can't make its own you know yeah it's apparently also like a like a adhd thing oh yeah yeah that's definitely me <laughs> <laughs> you only you drink something bad tasting for the effect only for medicine i exactly. i agree but i'm also like i don't want to take bad medicine like bad tasting medicine like if i have to sure but like I don't know. I'm a real. I love like pill-based medicine. Like, uh -huh. you don't gotta taste anything. Yeah, yeah, of course, of course. So, Sensu, who are you thinking about raiding? Um, let's see. Well, it's Black History Month, so I've been raiding Black creators. Uh, let me see about who I have. If you have a, if you have an opinion, though, tell me. Oh, um, I would, I would, would love if we could raid Kai. Kai? Okay. Yeah. I'll send their at in the chat. Okay. Yeah, sounds good to me. Alright, what are they playing? Oh, I think they're just watching videos right now. Oh, okay. I was I was one of the people we were supposed to do the, the Ultimate Chicken Horse collab with. Ah, uh, okay, which okay. I really wish you would have been able to do it. Oh, man, it was so fun. Yeah? Yeah, it was so fun. You definitely got to be on the next one. Yeah, yeah. I, um, as long as you tell me, like, more than a week in advance, I can always, like, yeah, figure I'll out my sure. schedule. Kai has been really wanting to play, so we'll definitely, I'll definitely set up the next one very soon. Yeah, sounds good. Alright, let me get the, okay, before I get the raid ready, because I won't be able to type once I get the raid ready. Uh, thanks for hanging out today with us, guys. Uh, please hang around for the raid. If you are a subscriber, here's your raid message. If you're not a subscriber, that's okay. Thanks for hanging out with us. Here's your raid message. Um, I'm going to copy paste this. I'm going to manually type in this. It should be fine. Um, hi, Skurp. You came just in time for a raid. <laughs> Thanks for popping by, though. I really appreciate it. Unless you've been lurking, which is fine, too. I need to do raid messages, too. 
I don't have good emotes though, but it's. <laughs> Aww, you can use like the, the. There's a lot of good like standard emotes. True. Yeah. Let us let us raid. Yeah, let's do it. Sorry, Skurb. I hope you have. I hope you had a good day though, and I hope you have a good time with the person that we're raiding. Kaisia, uh, how do I say it? Kaisia. Kaisia. Oh. Kaisia. Yeah. Okay. Oh, Kaisia. Okay. Yeah, I could see that. All right. Yeah. So send them our love. Uh, be nice. I know you guys are always nice, but be nice. <laughs> uh, make sure you get some water and some, uh... It can be a little food. intense over there. <laughs> Please. And not like, not like in an aggressive way. Just right, like, right. They kind of, I kind of an after hours streamer. If you get my <laughs> I see, I see. Well, that'll be a fun experience. Let's try it out. Uh, yeah, there we go. All right. Thanks for hanging out. I'll see you guys next time. I should actually, I should switch my offline. Yep. And then I realized, ah, damn it, damn it, hold on. I know, it's so cute. I love it. I'm in love with it. I'm waiting for their uh, for their ads to go through so I can press raid. <laughs> I realized I didn't pull them up on my other screen. Ah, oh, it said dump subway ad. The one where it's like a, a documentary. I do see it, yeah. Oh, it's okay. Everyone in my chat is usually over 18. 